Hey, it's Candace, and in today's QuickBooks Tips and Tricks, I'm going to show you if you're using QuickBooks Online, you're trying to send out emails, and you're noticing that they're coming from Intuit versus your email address. That's something you cannot change as far as I know with Intuit. I've asked them. It's a feature that's not changeable. So what you need to do, if you're having a problem, the question I received was they're trying to send them out, and because the email's not coming from them directly, it was getting denied from their customer that they were sending the invoice to. So one of the workarounds you can do is actually save it as a PDF and then send it out. There's always a couple ways to do things in QuickBooks. I'm gonna show you one of the ways. You go actually open your invoice. And when you go down here and you click send, save and send, you'll notice when, you, when it populates in here, there's a space on the right to download the invoice right here. See the little download button? You can actually download the invoice as a PDF We'll just say we're going to save it to our desktop, save it wherever you want, name it, you know, invoice number, the customer, whatever you want to name it, save it to your computer, and then send it as an attachment through your email is one of the options. It's not the most, the easiest thing to do, but it is an option. Another way to get to the same spot is if it's easier for you is to click print preview down here, print or preview, preview it. And then you'll also have an option to the exact same icon will come up and you can download it from this screen as well. See right here. You can also just send them an, a link to the invoice if that's easier. From your email, you can grab an invoice link, copy the link and email it. So you can either download it to PDF or you can send them the link. You can do that from here as well. Save and share the link and it gives you a link. All right. I hope this tip has been helpful. If you have any questions, feel free to comment below. And as always, up on the top right, you'll see an I. You can, if you need help with QuickBooks directly, you can book an appointment with me. Or if you would like to receive these tips and tricks in your inbox each week, you can go up to the I and put your name and email address in the link there or down below in the description. Have an amazing day. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye-bye.